matrix now suppose for all c belongs to c if the distance of r comma c is greater than or equal to 2 so in that case we can write r is equal to c plus e that is r is this message and e is this then we can find that the transmission error of weight 1 occurs in the second component of r and uh, suppose 1 is in the ith position of e we don't know where is this i uh, ith position that could be in the range from 1 to 6 because you have a 6 bit message then h into r transpose is equal to h into r is c plus e so h into c transpose plus h into r transpose which is equal to h into e transpose since h into c transpose is equal to 0 so which is equal to ith column of h it means there is an error in the ith column so suppose we receive this message find the syndrome if the question is asked h into r transpose you can observe here it is 111 which means that here it is not a exact code word for whatever we have received it is not belongs to the set of code words then you check whether this uh, 111 is matching with any of the columns so in this case it is not matching with any of the a single column also so you can observe here the syndrome does not match with any single column but this syndrome is obtained it can be obtained by the sum of two columns you can observe if you add first row and sixth row you will be getting this or if you add second row and fourth row you will get this uh, syndrome if you add third row and fifth row so again you will get uh, another uh, you get the same syndrome so we get three code words that is 100 110 010 011 and uh, 0 0 respectively by flipping the, the first and sixth bit by flipping the second and fourth bit by flipping third and fifth bits so, we cannot expect H to correct the multiple bit errors in this case because the minimum distance between the code words here is 3. Next, suppose the problem here is, suppose the problem says that with G equal to this matrix, this is a generator matrix, with this G, find the code words for 0, 1, 0, 0 1, 1 and 1, 0, 0. And the second part says that find the decoded message for these code words. So, we will take the first one. How to find the code words? So, the code word is obtained by taking the message multiplying by G. So, here message is 0, 1, 1 and this is a generator matrix. So, if you perform the binary uh, multiplication, so you can get this is the code word. So, that is 0, 1, 1 multiplied by 1, 0, 0 you get 0 because 0 into 1 plus 1 into 0 plus 1 into 0 you will get 0 then 0 into 0 0 plus 1 into 1 1 plus 1 into 0 1 0 so you will be getting the sum as 1 so this will be the code word next similarly for the message 100 0, 0, you will get getting the code word as 100110 0, 0, 1, 1, 0. So, that is nothing but you can observe that whatever the code word you got for the message 100 is the first row itself and for this message the code word will be the sum of the second and the third row. So, it is 0 plus 0 is 0, 1 plus 0 is 1, 0 plus 1 is 1, 0 plus 1 is 1, 0 plus 1 is 1, 1 and 1 plus 1 is 0. So, this is the code word. This is how I can find the code word. Next, we will see the decryption part. So, find the decoded messages for this message. So, for decoding message, I need the H matrix. So, how I should find the H matrix is this first part is the transpose of the last three. So, here this is my A, this is my A transpose. And this is the identity matrix. So, this is my H matrix. So, first you have to find the H matrix. Next, find the syndrome of R which is given by H into R transpose. H is we have already got here multiplied by R transpose. For this message, you take the message transpose that becomes actually a column matrix. So, here it is written as the transpose of this row matrix. So, now you match uh, 
perform the multiplication then you can observe that the message uh, the syndrome is 000 which means that the received message is a correct code word so by dropping the last three bits the message will be decoded as 100 so the decoded message will be 100 and the received message is a correct code word next for the second received message if you observe H into R transpose comes to 101 and this 101 is not 0 so it means there is an error in the received message so there is uh, some bits which may be flipped so it is not a correct code word and uh, to get the correct code word check whether this matches with any of the columns so in this case it matches with the third column it means by flipping the third bit of the received message so what I get is the correct code word so the correct code word is 110 101 and uh, by dropping the last three bits i'll be getting the decoded message as uh, by decoding message as 110 so it is not uh, just a minute a minute 